Church. We're so glad you guys are here with us. We are doing a Christmas series. We are going to be learning about the story of Jesus and why Christmas is so important. But first, we're going to do a song. Christmas series is the story of Jesus's birth and how that happened. So let's read our story. 
There was a young girl who was engaged to a man named Joseph. One morning, this girl was minding her own business when suddenly a great warrior of light appeared right there in front of her. He was Gabriel, and he was an angel, a special messenger from heaven. When she saw the tall, shining man standing there, Mary was frightened. You don't need to be scared, Gabriel said. God is very happy with you. Mary looked around to see if perhaps he was talking to someone else. Mary, Gabriel said, you're going to have a baby, a little boy. You will call him Jesus. He is God's own son. He's the one. He's the rescuer. But it's too wonderful, Mary said and felt her heart beating hard. How can it be true? Is anything too wonderful for God? Gabriel asked. So Mary trusted God more than what her eyes could see, and she believed. I am God's servant, she said. Whatever God says, I will do. Sure enough, it was just as the angel had said. Nine months later, Mary was almost ready to have her baby. Now Mary and Joseph had to take a trip to Bethlehem, the town King David was from. But when they reached the little town, they found every room was full. Every bed was taken. Each innkeeper told them, there isn't a place for you. Soon, Mary's baby would come. They couldn't find anywhere except an old tumble-down stable. So they stayed where the cows and the donkeys and the horses stayed. And there, in the stable, in the quiet of the night, God gave the world his wonderful gift. The baby that would change the world was born. Mary and Joseph named him Jesus, Emmanuel, which means God has come to live with us. And the world was never the same again. Special visitors can be so much fun, like your grandparents and aunts and uncles and cousins, or even friends who come over for a visit. When they arrive, you get hugs and high fives because they are so glad to see you. You play games and eat together and take trips around your town. But then it's time for the visitors to go home. That's the worst part. We hate when they leave. You wish that they could stay forever. When Jesus came to earth as a baby born to Mary, he was a very special visitor. And the best part is the this visitor will be with us always. Jesus came to rule over God's kingdom forever. Mary's baby was God coming to earth as a human baby, the one God had promised long ago to send, a baby who would be called Emmanuel, which means God with us. Jesus came to show us what God is like. He came to show us God's love and wants to be with us forever, here on earth and in heaven. Jesus died on the cross for our sins, but he was raised to life again. He lives forever and he is here. God with us, right now and for always. God will always be here like a circle. That means you always have a friend. In good times and bad times, wherever you are, whatever you're doing, you don't ever have to feel afraid or alone. Jesus is with you to guide you, to teach you, to laugh and cry with you, to love you and forgive you. God is always with us forever. So we're gonna do a craft. Today, we're making a Christmas wreath. You're gonna need three pipe cleaners, whatever colors you want. You're gonna take two and you're going to make, put it around your finger and spin them on both sides. And you're gonna do that all the way to the end. Then you're going to put them together. Then you'll take your second pipe cleaner. You're going to make a loop in the middle. And another loop. The 
take your wreath, you're going to wrap it around. And this is your Christmas wreath. We love you guys and we love the Christmas season about how Jesus came and he changed the world and it was never the same again. So we're going to pray for you guys. So dear Lord, thank you so much that you love us. Thank you that you are good and that you sent your son down to earth to come and to guide us and to lead us and to die for our sins on the cross and to raise again from the dead and walk with us in the everyday. Thank you that your love is everlasting and eternal and is always there. Help us to remember that in this Christmas season. In your name we pray. Amen. Bye!